Hi, this is Kana Babu. This is part 13 of link. In last video, we discussed about first of and first of the first or default method. In this video, we discuss about last of or last of or default method. So here, let us assume that you have something like this. I'll try to declare last of method is used to return the last element in the given sequence. Here, I'll try to declare using system using system dot link and here I'll declare a class A and in this class here I'll declare what one main method static void main and here I'll try to uh, create one array int ar is equal to new int of and the size of the array I'll give 5 and here I'll try to store the 5 elements in the given array 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and I want to read the last element in the given array so I can use er dot last of this last of method what it will do it will return the last element in the given array int i is equal to console dot write turn of i want to print the i value now here you see so what is the last element in the given sequence 6 so the output is 6 I press f5 and check the output you can get the output is what 6 here you see is it clear similarly um, if you want to get the uh, even number in the given sequence so last of method what it will do it will return the last even number that is 6 there are actually 3 even numbers are there 2 4 6 but last of method will return the last even number in the given sequence if you want you can say here i'll write er dot here i can use last of and it will write x is equal to greater than x modulus 2 x modulus 2 is equal to 0 and the return type of this method is what int int i equal to Right, I want to print the i value that is i. So here you see x is nothing but last term method internally within this method for each loop is there. Now it will move the point to the next position and read the first value that is 2. And 2 modulus 2 is equal to 0. Condition is true. Similarly 3. Condition is false. Similarly 4. Condition is true. Similarly 5. Condition is false. Similarly 6. Condition is true. So total how many even numbers are there? 2. 4 and 6. So, what is the last even number? That is 6. So, the output is 6. That's a 5. It will return the last element from the given sequence. Similarly, if I try to take one example, something like this. I declare one class with the name employee with two columns, E number as well as E name. And here I declared one collection, generic collection, list collection. And I created three objects. And here I, I, I want to return first or default means return the first element. Uh, I want to return the last object details. That is, this is first object, second object, and last object. So I'll try to use something like this. EMPs dot. Here I will use the method last or default of. And uh, here I will write uh, the return type. This, this uh, we already know these other collections. Collection at the moment group of objects in another object. That another object is EMPs. So last of last star default method will return which object? Last object. So I will try to store the result in one employee e1 equal to. And I will try to print console dot right line of e1 dot e number. And I want to print the employee name. Console dot right line of e1 dot e name. So press F5 and check the output. It will return the last element. That is 1 not 3 Ajay. Last star default method will return what? Last element from the given sequence. This is how you can work with last star, last star default method. In the next video, I will discuss about singular, singular default method. For more videos, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel, Facebook group. Thank you.